everyone. I wanted to talk to you guys about these runabouts and so show you some videos of my gliders using them. Uh, so this one actually was gifted to me and it was made by a friend, but I'm gonna include in the description box a couple places where you can actually buy, buy these. I don't know how to make them, otherwise I would teach you how. I didn't make this myself, somebody else made it and then get, gifted it to me. So anyway, I, I really, really like these. Um, I don't, my gliders don't use it every day, but the cool thing about them is that they, I know that they like them because gliders are really smart. I don't just take them out and put them in there. I always let them choose to go in. So what I do is I let the gliders get up at night. So they've already woken up for the night. They're out, they got most of their poop and pee out of their system. And then what I do is I just open the cage door like this and I have this open and I just offer them to go in. And most of the time they choose to go in. So if they don't, then I just put it away and they don't use it. Uh, so usually every other night, one of my gliders uses it for about an hour. Um, it's really, really fun for them just to be able to explore the house and get some exercise and things like that. So please don't substitute this for a hamster ball. This is very, very specifically made for gliders. That would be like saying, well, you can just get a hamster wheel for your gliders. There's many issues with that. So please don't even try to do that. And I talked about that in another video. I won't go into that. I'll just link that in the description box. But these runabouts are super fun, you guys. I really encourage you guys to invest in one. It's a great enrichment for them and I've really been enjoying it. I didn't think that my gliders would really like it, to be honest. I thought like, oh, that's, I think they're just gonna like sit in it and do nothing. Belky likes it, Stella Luna loves it. And Pika is still getting used to it. She's just a little bit more timid to even come to me. So, but there has been times where I've opened this up and offered it to her and she has jumped right in. So gliders are very, very intelligent. And once they've been in this one time, you might wanna incentivize them with treats the first time to get them to go in and then just do a very, very short interaction so that you don't get, up, get them to where they don't like it. But if they didn't like it, they wouldn't go in it. So it's not like, you know, I'm torturing them. And what I do after they've been in it for a little while, I open this up and I offer them to come out. I put my hand in or put, you know, make it clear that the door is open and usually they wanna stay in there longer. So usually about every 20 minutes or so, I offer them to get out, but eventually I just have to kick them out usually because I'm like, hey, I gotta go to bed. <laughs> so anyway, I'll include some video clips to let you guys see them using it. Um, I have some video clips from the first time that Belki used it, just to show you that it takes them a little bit of time to get used to it, just the rhythm of it and how it works, it's new. It's first time in the runabout. Come get the get the feather. I'm gonna teach him how to move it forward. Come get the feather, buddy. Come on, bud. It takes him a little bit to even figure out what the heck's going on. He's like, uh, this is weird. What do you think, huh? What do you think of that? Come on, baby boy. Come on, baby boy. Took him a minute, but he's figuring it out. <laughs> Not sure what to think yet, are ya? Whoa! Sorry for the background noise, you're popping popcorn, but I took him out one time and let him voluntarily go back in. Just to, I didn't want him to think he was trapped in there. But he's really starting to figure it out now. He's able to figure out how to maneuver it. <laughs> I think he's gonna end up loving it once he figures out how to do what he's how to do it. Yeah, let's get away from the <laughs> He's actually going backwards. Mmm, <laughs> that's gonna be pretty fun, huh buddy? Oops, let's turn you over. Oh. My time's up, man, my turn. <laughs> you go forward like this? Yeah. He's a good boy. I tried to get him out just now and he didn't want to get out, so I think he's having fun. Looks 
Eskimo Daddy's popcorn. There you go. You can have it, huh? <laughs> so, yeah. That's all I have to say about that. I hope you guys enjoy. Be free. Be free. Be free to subscribe and hit the like button. You be free to do that, okay? Okay. Bye-bye.